Well, hey everyone, I'm Keith Farron and you've heard me talking about this for several weeks now. Well, Bible Praying for Parents is officially out today, July 5th, 2017. So I'm recording this one informally on my phone, sitting in my living room, because I really want Bible praying to just be a normal part of life. Behind me is the corner of my couch where I sit and I read my Bible in the mornings as well as pray the Bible for my own three kids. I was first introduced to this concept of Bible praying by Judy Fetzer, my co-author in this, about five years ago or so. Now Judy, who has three grown children now, started praying the Bible over her kids when she was part of the Moms in Prayer ministry when her kids were in preschool. Now, Bible praying is exactly what it sounds like. It's praying the words of Scripture. Because as parents, we know that we should pray for our kids. We want to pray for our kids. Maybe we do pray for our kids. But frequently, I find that that for me, before I started Bible praying, that prayer was was often... A, a, a quick, repetitive prayer, you know, the God, please bless my kids today, keep them safe, protect them, help them have a good day, and and then we'd go on. Well, there are, our kids' lives have so many different elements to them, don't they? I mean, there are friendships, anxiety, temptations, their schoolwork, their own your jobs if they're a little older, and their relationship with us, their relationship with each other as siblings. There's so many different things, and the Bible has something to say about all of those. So the beauty of Bible praying is that when we pray the words of God, we are praying the will of God. And so the first section of this book takes 365 different scriptures, puts blanks in there where you can... Uh, insert your child's name, gives you the scripture reference, gives you the focus and the category that, that, is, that that's in, so that you can pray a simple prayer that over the course of each month, each year, each year we are praying uh, for the kind of the totality of our child's life. So that's the first section. The second section, we've taken those 20 or so categories and taken all the prayers from throughout the year that fit into that category and put those together. So if you want to specifically pray about your child's relationships or your child's faith or, your, or anxiety or something like that, that you can go to that category section and pray all the prayers that are in the book about that section with the references listed there. Then there is a third section, third and final section to the book, your Bible blessings. I think we've kind of lost the, the art or the habit of blessing our children. We look throughout scripture and blessing from the, from the Old Testament through is, it was an important part of raising children and speaking a blessing to and for and over our kids is just that, a blessing. It is, you know, who doesn't need to be blessed more? Well, our kids need to be blessed. And so we've taken 43 different blessings straight from Scripture that you can say and pray and speak right to your kids. Now, I'll tell you, they may be uncomfortable a little bit at first, or they may just kind of look away or whatever, but as you speak that, um, it, they, the, the smile comes and I've even had my kids say thanks uh, several times after blessing them. So Bible praying for parents is out and for those of you that are seeing this video right in this first week, one thing to just kind of get things going is uh, is I so many of you know that I've written another book for parents called Like Ice Cream. Uh, which is uh, the nine principles for passing on a love for God's word to the next generation. Well, what I want to do is kind of give you the parent pack. If you buy Bible Praying for Parents during this first week when it's launching, then I want to give you a copy of Like Ice Cream for free so that you've got both of the books that I've written for parents. So the instructions for doing that are right below this video and how you can get your free copy and where you can buy it and all that. But uh, if you're a youth pastor, children's pastor, family pastor, you want to have multiple of them, then go directly to keithferron.store and you can get uh, their, those uh, bulk discounts if you buy more than 10. So 
Bible Praying for Parents. Grab your copy, use it, start praying the Bible for and over your kids. God bless you.